Hi guys and welcome to the channel. Join me as I walk around Hisarano, Olodanez, Fethiye and anywhere else I can find in Turkey that will have me. Anyhow, please like, subscribe and share. Thanks a lot guys. They deliver the bread and they leave it on the side of the things. Look, everybody's there. Booty will be open shortly. So I will go in there and get a haircut. Look at that big dog, look, I'm going for a walk. Anyhow, I think maybe we'll walk up the strip. Half past eight. Happy feet's just about to open. A lot of the places are starting to open, but you've got to remember in October, because we are October the 9th, October the 9th, it's coming to the end of the season, so they're not going to get up early and be grafting and working out early. Why would they? They've had a hard season. Looks like they're still doing the Sunday roast. We may have to partake, but I think we're going to go to... Um, We're going to go to Ocean Blue for our Sunday roast because I really, really like it there. I really do. Let's just have a little walk, guys. The sun is bright coming down here now, this morning. Just looking to see if Billy was about. He's normally in there really early in the morning. Some people are very sad like me, they get up early. Do you know I was up at 5.30 this morning, which is 3.30 in England. That's just my life though. Winter clearance look. So this is the good thing about October, guys. You'll start to see the sales and some of it can be 50% off. And I'm, I'm not just saying that, you know, watches that you pay 200 quid for are now 100 pound. Hoodies that you pay 30 quid for, or 25 quid for, or 10 quid. You do get a lot of a lot of sales stuff at this time of year. It's absolutely crazy. I think maybe the first hairdressers that I see open, I'm going to go in and have my hair cut. <laughs> Why wait? I hope that sun's not killing you guys. It's bloody killing me. I'll turn the camera sideways. I'm even that early, newest looks not open, and he's up early every day. He's up and at it. But I'm gonna walk up to the top so I can walk all the way back down and see things open up. That's the plan. There is a master plan there. But look, everywhere shut. It's like a ghost town. I'm gonna cross over where the sun's not beating my head in. Look, if you want a football shirt, just come and nick one from TK Maxx. See what I mean about the bread? They deliver the bread early in the morning, drop it off at the establishment, ready for people to use later on in the day. More bread delivered here, and that's what they do. Look at the top of the mountain up there. Chicken wraps and chips. 180. Who'd have thought you'd have music on at this time in the morning? <laughs> Electric scooter. There you go, get three items, pay for two you will start to see them sort of things come out now, guys. There'll be lots of um, cheap stuff. That's part and parcel for sales though, isn't it? End of season, it's the same anywhere. If you go to Blackpool, it's exactly the same. Be no different. I do like to come out for a morning walk, you know, guys. I really do. Should have bought my drone, actually. It's a great time to video 
do drone footage early in the morning. No one's about. You don't get told off. <laughs> and then it looks strange, look. That wall there is normally covered in items. <laughs> Crazy stuff. Always someone in star, look, no matter what time of day it is, look. Already open. That's mental. Mr. Schumann. Good morning. You alright? You're out very early. Some of the traders are always up. Busy. Talk of the town, someone's in there. Oh, TJ, blimey. He's always up early though. Good morning, how are you? Good night then. TJ, you're always up, aren't you? Always awake. Always here. Uh, Im. Im? Im, is that correct? Is getting better. Is Im? What is Im? Im. What does that mean? Good. Im means I am all right. Wolves. Wolves. Different shirt every time. How are you? Are you well? I am well. You're colour coordinated today as well, aren't you? Green, black. I like it. And uh, what is going on, all man? One winner. Why not? Why not? Why not? Why not? Toss the coin, let's see. You all right? Yeah. I'm back, I'm back. No, no, I'm good. Got to the top of the strip, went and said hello to TJ, as you've seen. And then, you know what, I need some T-shirts because, I don't know, when you put a bit of weight on or you take a bit of weight off, you need to change T-shirts. So I thought I'll pop into Google Fashion. And yes, the first sale of the day was made. I have bought three T-shirts, as you'll see me wearing them, off the Harry Potter boy at the back there. Always does me a good deal. See all them T-shirts there? They're all 5XL, and that's what he bought out for me. Now, please don't think I'm super fat 5XL, because 5XL here is probably a 3XL in England. So, thank you. It's so flattering. <laughs> and we tossed a coin, guys. So, he wanted X amount of pound. I wanted to pay, say, say it was like 35. I wanted to pay 30. He wanted me to pay 35. And he said, let's toss for it. So I tossed the coin and I lost. So it cost me a fiver, extra bloody fiver. But hey, I don't mind. Um, so Google Fashion, top of town. Um, been in here many times. They have the sales rack. They do all your hats. They do all your hoodies, all your white fucks, all your tap star. All sorts. You've seen my videos in here before. They will have a deal with you. They're very welcoming to toss a coin and see who wins. He loves, he's a gambling man, so he wins. Um, but it's very early in the morning and they're open as well. So if you want something really quickly in the morning, you're off out, come in, see them. Come and see. I ain't even going to bother doing site prices, guys, because we've done them a million times, haven't we? You already know what they are in here. But he does have some nice kit. Look, I mean, look at that Hugo Boss t shirt. A lot of the trouble is they do sizes for your average man. I'm a bit larger than your average man, so I do struggle a bit sometimes. We love a sale rack, though. Look, a sale rack. Can't beat a sale rack, guys. How much are football certs at the moment, boss? It's the same price, my friend. You know? Not dropping yet? No. £10. Come on, don't be tight. £10. Pounds. Three for 25 If you want to pay three for 25 you can do it. Three for 20 and toss a coin for the five. If you win, you can. There you go, look, see? If you win, you can, but I think I will win. <laughs> the gambling man. Anyhow, there we go, Google Fashion. My first sale of this holiday was in there. Right, guys, we are back in Umut Cap. Sadie's gone next door to get her eyes done. Anna's eaten all the lemon meringue, so we're in trouble with that. Steve, he's not allowed any more watches. Don't even look at my watch, you're not allowed. And he's gonna get me lemon meringue now. She's having hers in a takeaway box for later on, but look, that's it. At three o'clock, that's it, left. And these two ladies are gonna fight with us because we've had the last pieces. Sadie had the lemon, I mean, look at that lemon meringue. That's ridiculous. And me and Steve have gone for the carrot cake, so we'll tuck into this and let you know what it's like. We know what that's like, but what's this like? Let's have a little go, shall we? You love watching me eat, don't you guys? <laughs> Nothing like watching a fat bloke eat a cake. Oh, mint. That's good, well, not mint, but 
you know, carrot. Hmm? Mm. Why do they call it carrot candy? Because there is carrot, There is carrot, it? carrot in it. You see the carrot? Mm-hmm. Or McCaff. The carrot cake is banging. Thanks for watching, guys. Hit that notification bell to catch me on my next one.